Hi, what's your name? My name is Ashley. Nice to meet you. Um, what elective are you coming from? Spanish. Cool. Um, what are you guys learning in Spanish right now? Uh, we're learning like everyday stuff like what's in classrooms, what's in homes, our names, what we like. Cool. Um, would you recommend Spanish to an incoming sixth or seventh grader? Yeah, because uh, it's fun and like you learn new stuff about the spa um, like Spanish countries and how to speak Spanish. Cool, thank you. Hello, I'm Mrs. Nair. What electives will you be offering next year? So next year, all this, this is computer class. So next year's elective will be, other than the wheel class, which is two wheel class which six readers take, there will be computer project class, um, video production class, media graphic design class, um, computer application class, and computer science class. All of them are different classes using different apps in here. Okay. What's your name? I'm Mrs. Yamshan. And what will mm -hmm. you be offering next year? I'll be offering leadership again. And a leadership is a year-long class uh, with and I have two different periods. Awesome. And uh, what do you do in leadership? A lot of things. So if you're someone who hangs out outside at lunch and you ever see games up on the stage, my leadership class is responsible for that. We also throw all of the uh, events that are happening on campus like dances, spirit days, and pep rallies. The class also does fundraisers. Right now we're working on the SPCA fundraiser, but we're also responsible for the holiday toy drive for our sister school. And we have other committees that work on social media advertising, digital advertising, all the lovely, beautiful posters that you see around campus my class does. And yeah, we're just really working on spreading positivity and inclusivity on the campus. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, what's your name? My name is Mrs. Robinson. And what elective will you be offering next year? Next year, we're gonna be offering yearbooks slash publications which yearbook is we create the yearbook throughout the year and then when we're finished with that we will write the Pine Valley Pine Cup which is our school's newspaper. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, what's your name? I'm Mrs. Schlentz. What electives will you be offering next year? Well there's a long list of them. Um, starting off we'll have drama which is perfect for the kid who is interested in theater, but isn't quite sure if they want to be on stage in front of people yet, because everything's done in the classroom. Then there's advanced drama. That's for the kid who really wants to be in a play. And we put on different plays each semester. I have a new class next year that's gonna be called improv, which is all gonna be about improv games, improv activities, maybe putting an improv team together. We'll see how that works out. The next class I'm teaching is clothing. Clothing is the beginning class for anyone who's interested in learning how to sew, both with their hands and with machines. Um, we'll do some cross stitch, some embroidery, and you'll learn how to build a, a make a, a pillowcase and maybe even some pajama pants. New for next year, we're gonna have clothing too, which is the next level of clothing. And it's going to be more project-based and individually determined. You get to decide what projects you want to work on. And we might learn a little bit of quilting as well. You can sign up for both Clothing One and Clothing Two, and you'll be putting Clothing One first semester and Clothing Two second semester. My last one is Speech and Debate. Speech and Debate is a fun class for kids who maybe their parents tell them they're really good at um, arguing or they want to be lawyers. It's giving speeches in class and at the end of the semester we have a lot of debates. So there's a lot of fun classes I'll be offering. So if that sounds like you, then you should sign up for these electives. Thank you. Hi Mr. Rigoni, what electives will you be teaching next year? Uh, Alright, so for 7th and 8th graders, next year we have two band options and two string options. So we have, for band, we have concert band, and symphonic band and for strings we have orchestra and chamber orchestra. Both symphonic band and chamber orchestra are audition based. I will talk to all the sixth graders and 
and seventh graders this year about how to audition for symphonic jazz and chamber orchestra. And if you don't want to audition and you just want to sign up to play strings or band next year, then just sign up for strings or band and you'll be in concert band or orchestra. Thank you. Not a problem. Trisha Graham. And what electives will you I'm, be offering? Next okay, week? I'm I'm doing art one, advanced art, crafts, wheel, art therapy, um, all kinds of creative stuff. And There's no limit. What do you do in each class? Uh, well, I teach them all kinds of technical skills, but more importantly, we do a little bit of soul searching, where we do some writing and some creative thoughts about why we're doing what we're doing and who are we. Um, we do painting and sculpting, two and three dimensional. We paint rocks, we paint the ceiling, we paint doors, we paint stools, chairs, e even each other. Right. Thank <laughs> okay. you. You're welcome. I'm teaching French and I'm teaching food. Thank you.